Hi, welcome back to my channel, or welcome if this is your first time uh, viewing my channel. Today we will be going over uh, two of my subscription boxes that I have. Um, one, one of them is Ipsy, um, and it is ten dollars a month, and you get uh, five items. Uh, most of them are like travel size or trial size. Sometimes you get a full size product. Uh, the other is my Medusa's makeup. That one is fifteen dollars. Um, and you get anywhere from four to five items. They're all full size. They're all cruelty free and vegan. Uh, so that is a huge bonus for a lot of people out there who are on the cruelty free side of makeup. Uh, it's definitely something to look into. Um, so we will go over what I got this month. We will start with Ipsy because a lot of it is stuff that I'm not even going to be able to try on uh, today just for the simple fact of the kind of items that it is. Uh, the first one is being this nail polish that I got. Um, it is a very pretty color. It, I don't know the name of the color, but it is charcoal infused nail polish by Nailmatic. Um, it's almost like a bluish gray color. Uh, it looks very pretty. Um, possibly the next time I go to have my nails done, I might actually use this color. The other thing in there was the Skin Iceland, and this is the Icelandic Relief Eye, Eye Cream. I've actually uh, used this a couple of times so far already and really enjoy the way it makes my skin feel under my eyes. Um, so this is really nice. And I believe I've gotten something from them before uh, that was like some kind of face cream or something that I really did enjoy. Okay, and the next thing that we have is this Hendali Papaya Enzyme Powder Cleanser. Uh, I believe that this is a dry shampoo slash kind of like uh, builds body for your hair. I uh, have not tried this. I've never actually tried the powder kind of dry shampoos. I've always just used the spray. But I do like the idea that they come individually packed so that's something that you can just like throw in your bag if you're going on a quick trip or something and you want to have dry shampoo but you can't bring the whole big giant er, can of spray. Um, so I do look forward to using this and seeing how it works. Uh, the next thing I got in this month's bag up for Ipsy is the Essence Satin Touch Blush and this is in the color Satin Coral. Um, I've heard a lot of people rave about this blush so I'm glad that I did get it so that I could try it out. Now I do not have blush on at this time so I am going to go ahead and put some of this on so we can see what it looks like real quick. And as you can see, it gives a nice kind of coral look to it. It is a very pretty blush, uh, so I am happy about that. And this is what this month's bag looks like. It looks like it has like a lace print to it, but obviously it's not lace. Um, but it is still a super cute bag, so very excited for that there. Um, so now we will get into our... Uh, October Beauty box from Medusa's Makeup. It does come with this nice uh, card here that you could actually frame if you wanted to, that kind of thing. But it does show the information on the back of all the items that I got. Like I said, it's cruelty free and vegan. Um, so and I, this month, the retail value is $41, which is very nice considering the box was only $15. Um, now the first thing I'll go over is the, this is the glitter in, what is it called, this? yeah just glitter in Ziggy, this is $8. It is a very pretty, I don't know if you can see it, but it is a very pretty pink glitter. Um, I just don't use glitters. I don't have glitter glue to even use glitters for. Uh, so right now I'm just kind of stocking up on them and maybe eventually I'll be able to like sit down and actually do something with uh, these glitters. 
like I said, they're very fine milled uh, cosmetic glitter. Really pretty. Uh, so I do look forward to using it at one point in time. Uh, let's see here. Now, oh, one thing I for mm, one thing that I forgot from the Ipsy is this is the what did they call this? It is from It Cosmetics, and this is the Bye Bye Pores Pressed Powder. This is a um, translucent translucent powder, um, and it is this one here. I've already deep and it and put it in my Z palette, um, but it is this one right here in the middle at the bottom. So let me go ahead and we will put some of that on uh, before I jump back into the before I jump back into the Medusa's makeup. And what I'll do is go ahead and just re-tap under my eyes, make sure I don't have any creases um, before adding this powder. And pretty much just adding it to areas of the face that I feel would need some of this translucent powder to help from getting shiny in those areas. Alright, now I can jump back over to the Medusa makeup because, yeah. So, our next thing is this eye dust in the color Night Owl. This is $10 and let's see if it'll show up. It's a very pretty, very sparkly colored purple. Um, so we will go ahead and we will put this on the eye so we can see how it looks. Now because it is a loose pigment, you don't want to so much sweep it over the eye, but pat it on first so that way you don't have a lot of fallout with this color. And once you get it on the desired area, then you can kind of sweep lightly just to blend out those edges. That is a very sparkly, very pretty color. All right, and let's see here. So after that, the other thing we got that I was looking forward to is the Witch Lash Mascara. Um, this is in Black Noir, and this is $12, so we will go ahead and we'll try this. Ooh. Now the wand is very thin, which I do like. Um, another thing about it is the, the wand is very flexible, so that's really nice. Let's just see how well it works on the lashes though. Now we'll go ahead and zoom you back in for this so that you can see. The wand seems to do a pretty good job at separating the lashes. And the mascara seems to, the formula itself, 
Uh, it seems to be very nice. Uh, it does a good job with the lengthening. Um, the volume is okay. It's not the best, but definitely can't complain. I do like the way that it looks. As you can see, between this eye who has none and this eye that does, so that's very nice. a lot and the last thing that I got um, which I was happy for because I've already gotten one color from them let me turn this back out so that way you're not all up in my face when I'm talking about it this is the metal AF lip gloss um, in the color kiss me deadly uh, now it says it's a lip gloss but it's more just a metallic uh, lip liquid lipstick uh, that dries down matte. Um, it is a very comfortable formula. Uh, like I said, I have a, another one in the color. Let me see. Uh, this also have this one, which is in the color cherry pie. It's a very nice one. I'll swatch that one here in a minute. But let's go ahead and put this one on. Very, very pretty color. Shines very bright. And I will also, like I said, swatch the two colors on my hand for you here so you can see what they look like. Now they do have a pretty good range of these colors. Um, I just have the two so far. So this one here is the uh, Kiss Me Deadly, and then this one here is the Cherry Pie. Um, now, it usually always comes with one of these little pamphlets that kind of let you know, like the monthly beauty box, the items that you will get in it, which is anywhere from eye dust, glitter, eyeshadow, mascara, cheek stain, lip gloss, lipstick lip paint, blush bronzer, setting spray, brushes, eyelashes, and neon pigments. Um, and you can just go on to the medusamakeup.com to subscribe to it. But it also, when you open it up here, it has the whole list of everything that you can actually buy if you wanted to of their items. Um, and like I said, with the, the lip gloss metal AF, they have one. They have eight different colors, um, so it's a pretty nice range. Uh, most of them are very light colored. Let's see if it'll focus here, maybe. There we go. Um, as you can see, they're very light colored lip colors, but they're all seem very pretty. Um, I hope to be able to own them all here very soon, because I, like I said, I do like the formula. Uh, once it dries down, you pretty much forget that you're even wearing it. So that is very nice. Uh, all right, so I hope that you like the look that I came up with today uh, using all of my subscription boxes for the month of October. Um, my first video that I release will be of my BoxyCharm 
and the items that I used in it and then going over into this video with the Ipsy and the Medusa's makeup. Thank you for watching. If you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel and hit the little notification bell so that way you get reminded of the times when I actually upload my videos. Um, I want to thank you for watching along with me. If you do like the video, please give it a thumbs up. And I thank you again and hope to see you in my next video.